Hello everyone, welcome back to this week's video. So this week is a very, very, very exciting one because it's going to be a come with us to get our new pony. So you're probably like, what, what? <laughs> Um, so me and my sister we share Rambo so obviously it's quite hard to like share him so we I'm so lucky to be able to say that we are going to get another one um, and obviously we're going to keep Rambo don't you worry but we're just going to get another one as well so we are going to view one tomorrow which is crazy um, I'll tell you more about him tomorrow but this video I'm just going to bring you along the whole entire journey of buying a horse because I know I love seeing them too so I thought you guys might like to as well um, as you don't see many of these so I thought yeah so I thought you might you guys might like to as well oh dear so I'm going to bring you along the whole journey to the vetting, bring them home, everything, and the vet viewing even, so yeah. So it's now the morning before we go to view the horse, um, and we're just having a quick little pop on Rambo, he hasn't jumped in like a month or something, so just have a quick pop on him just so we feel ready, as I haven't jumped in so long, um, so yeah. on our way to go and view him if you haven't already once you've watched this one go check out my last vlog where i introduce you to my new pony so we saw him get run first and then i got on and i gave him more ground so both the ponies we tried at this yard are very very green and quite young so obviously they're not it not everything's perfect so yeah so then I started trotting and he was he's very very sweet he's a little bit more leg on but he's still like forward moving um and he was really like gave you a really nice feel his flat his jumping's better but he's got a lot to work on with his flat work his flat work's definitely the thing that's more green so then I popped him into a canter and it was really really lovely Again, as you can see, he's baby, so he's still got lots to learn on the flat. But again, that's what we're going to work on. And then I take him over a crossbow in a second. I did jump an upright, but I can't. I don't know if my dad didn't film them, but I can't find any videos of me jumping anything other than the cross. So you can watch those because you get the idea of it. But yeah, as you can see in there, his jumping is a lot better. Is more experienced in his flat work. Obviously he is a baby so it's not perfect, but it's definitely better than his flat work, but that's completely okay. And then he went over this cross again, which he's got a lovely, lovely pop on him. And then oh we've got one video of this brick wall. But all the other videos are gone somewhere. And he was so lovely, so he really liked him. So then we got in this lovely little mare, who I would say is flat works a little bit more experienced. Again, she's only four, so she's very, very, very young, and obviously very inexperienced. But I would say her flat works a little bit nicer than her jump than the others pony. But again, that's something we can work on, and she was very very sweet but you could tell she's a year younger how baby she was but she was lovely and if Rambo wasn't quite so crazy still then I probably would have moved forward with her but he 
yeah, because her jumping, I didn't jump her in these videos, but her jumping is very green and she's still learning to jump. And we want something that's got a little bit more experience jumping, which the other one did. Her canter again is super cute. She's such a pretty colour. So is the other one actually. They're both gorgeous, but yeah. Obviously she'll most likely grey out, which is sad. So here you see her transition, which again is very baby, but really, really nice. So yeah, we definitely probably preferred the other one a little bit over her. Obviously no for our own, we just clicked better with him. So yeah. So the exciting news is that the Dun Pony reviewed that you saw in those videos had his bet in this morning and he passed it with flying colours and absolutely everything so I'm super excited to say that he's going to be coming home on Friday and it's now Tuesday so we've only got a few days <laughs> we've got a few days to prepare everything to pack his state pack get his stable sorted out to get his stable sorted out to get go to the tax shop to buy everything so yeah <laughs> so I'll bring you guys along so we're now at the tax shop and we're going to get stuff for him Thursday and we're at the yard again so we're picking her up tomorrow so we're just sorting out his stable and all the bits we've got him today so and we're going to sort out our little tack box thing so it's clean because it's a state in a minute so we're now going to clear our box out I'll show you in a second how awful it is and um, yeah.
stirrup leathers. On our saddle. So we've got our stirrups on our saddle. So we've got both saddle and then the new one saddle. So we're just gonna put saddle cover on, cover on it. So now the box has been sorted and we've taken all the, all the cobwebs out of this stable. Now it looks a lot more used or a lot more clean, ready to be used. We're just getting the bed in that's out because some of it's still a bit wet from the last horse that was in here. Um, and that's the treat ball that Rambo just uses to get his anger out and doesn't actually use it to get treats out. So yeah, we're just gonna do the stable now. a big bed and sorted it all out so next is to fill up the hay net so we've just put the bridle together so we've put the bit on put the reins on and put the martingale on as well so the bridle's all ready and now we're just going to put the salt lick up so we've got rambo's and his head collar, we've got a spare head collar under there. The, that one. And then he's got chili at the minute out. Fly spray. And a little brushing thing. And then here we've got his, the head collar that our new one's going to be wearing. A hoof pick. It usually does go there, but I thought I'd put it there. So and obviously Rambo's there. And he's in this stable. Which is all ready. So we're just going to put his bridle up there. It's now raining a bit heavier, but the last thing to do is to wipe down this window inside now. So I can see out a bit better. <laughs> We didn't need to buy us loads of stuff, but we did still get a decent amount of stuff. So the first thing we've got is this um, thing for the field, because they're going up together. So this is to go over our field gate, so we can put their headquarters on it. We just have this plain snaffle bit. And then we've got these blue themed bells, because Rambo has them in pink. They look massive, they're not. He has them in pink. We got him in blue because we think they look really nice in blue. And then we've got these overreach boots. And salt lick because that's what Ram has at the minute and he loves it. So we thought we'd get him one too. And then we've got his martingale because that's what he's ridden in the minute and he needs one. So. It's just a plain manure one, really. Nothing interesting about it. We'll put holes put in them because we bought dog size, but we can get more holes just put in them. And we've got these feed covers to put on his feed bowls. No one's going to personalise them. Um, so, yeah. We've also ordered some stirrups, which is really exciting. They should be coming tomorrow, so I'll show you all them. But we've wanted these stirrups for so long, so. I cannot wait. They're really nice and grippy and everything. So the reins we'll be using. This bridle, again, it's always like a big standard bridle. And we've also got this brow band, which is 
I'm not going to focus on either. Um, yeah, it's just like a plain bridal. And the last thing is this mug. Well, we pretty much have all the rugs we need already. Um, so tomorrow we're going to be setting up this stable and everything, and then he'll be coming home the next day. So I'll see you then. So it's Friday, which is the day we're picking him up, which I actually cannot believe. Um, so he's on his way at the minute. The reason we are getting him brought to us is because my dad's away and he's the one who drives our trailer and we didn't want to wait till he's back. So he's on his way with a transport company. Um, so he's going to be here in not long at all. So we need to get dressed and get down the yard. But everything's ready for him. So yeah, can't wait and I'll keep you guys updated. So it's now about three-ish and we're just going to the yard now and he'll be there soon. settled in he's super happy he's a little bit nervous obviously he's in a new place him and Rambo have kind of met and they seem to get on quite well and um, we're just giving him some water in the bucket because he has got an electric drink cup he doesn't quite understand it yet so we're just going to make sure but yeah I'll keep you guys updated on what we do next So we're just taking him for a little in-hand walk and now we're making their feeds to feed them both. So we're just making his feeds now. So I'm just going to do a quick round up of like the day. 
So it's now 8.30 and we're just about to go down for night checks. We usually wouldn't, but as it's his first night, we just want to make sure he's all settled and everything. I'm sure he will be. And make sure he's got plenty of pay, which again, I'm sure he will because we gave him loads, but we don't really know how much he will eat. So we'll just do that to double check. Um, But yeah, he was really settled this morning. Um, this e this afternoon we got him. He was obviously a little bit nervous, but he wasn't that bad, and he is a lot more settled now. And when he and Rambo met for the first time, it didn't go quite to plan. Rambo was just being Rambo, as you'd have seen, but they are getting along better. And when we got back from the hack with Rambo, um, Bounty neighed at Rambo, um, and they neighed at each other. So maybe they'll. Hopefully they'll like each other soon, but yeah, I'll probably, and I probably won't bring you along guys tonight. So obviously the rest, he'll be in most, he'll be in all of the rest of the vlogs. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and I'll see you in next week. Bye.